But when they protect the Minuteman missiles, well, now that's another story. The Minuteman missiles are widely dispersed. Each of the bases previously mentioned has up to 20 launch control facilities, buried almost three stories underground. Each of these control facilities controls 10 Minuteman missiles, located in secure, unmanned launch facilities placed from 4 to 40 miles around the launch control facility. These unmanned sites are protected by a highly sophisticated surveillance system, which is monitored on a 24-hour basis by a missile combat crew composed of two officers stationed at each launch control facility. The missile combat crews work deep in the ground, behind blast doors that weigh almost eight tons, which gives adequate protection and maintains their capability of launching the missiles in the event of enemy missile attack. Each combat crew member is issued an individual combination which opens the safe containing the missile launch keys. The crew must function jointly to accomplish their particular part of the overall missile launch program. They continually monitor the surveillance system that protects the 10 missiles, as well as the immediate area around each launch facility. Inside the fence at each launch facility, there are outer zone radars which can detect any object weighing 50 pounds or more, should the object penetrate the electronic field. The system is so sensitive, any unauthorized movement is immediately known to the combat crew. In addition to the outer zone protection, there's an inner zone tamper-proof seismic alarm system within each launcher. Any unauthorized weight, vibration, or tampering can trigger the alarm system and thus warn the combat crew at the control site several miles away. When launch control and launch facilities are protected by such a sophisticated system, the logical question arises, why do they need security police? How do they fit in the security system? Well, the security police furnish the muscle. They give armed protection to back up the unmanned electronic system. They guard and protect the facility should the electronic system have a malfunction.